Hi, I'm Christy Caldwell, Research Librarian at UC Santa Cruz. I am here today with Daniel Story, the Digital Scholarship Librarian. Hi, Daniel. Hi, Christy. So what do you want grad students to know about the Digital Scholarship Department? Uh, well, first things first, during the remote times that we're living through right now, we want you to know about some of our online resources. And uh, first of all, we offer we are offering a range of online workshops coming up this fall quarter on topics like audio editing, video editing, 3D design, uh, digital mapping. And then you can also find on our website um, recorded workshops that we've offered in the past around those and other topics. The other thing on our website you can find are our tutorials and resources section, uh, which is constantly expanding. And it's organized around the different digital methods that we support, um, like audio, video, mapping, text analysis, etc. And you can find um, tutorials on specific software there, and sometimes on research workflows and different tips and tricks for, for the different digital approaches that, that we support. The other thing that we want you to know is that um, we're actively interested in supporting your research as grad students and um, any kind of teaching responsibilities that you might have that, that would intersect with digital methods and tools. So you can reach out to us by email, uh, but another great way uh, for us to help you would be to set up a Zoom consultation with us. Um, we're happy to sit down and talk about your research questions, your research project, the workflow, um, and you know, reach out to us early in your process because we're more than happy to help you think through kind of from the ground up how a particular digital method might intertwine with, with your research uh, questions and your research um, output eventually. Um, and of course, if you have any uh, teaching responsibilities as a grad student and you have the opportunity to introduce a digital uh, approach to students, we're also um, geared up to help support you in designing digital assignments and helping students, supporting your students as they complete those digital assignments. When we're back in person, can you describe some of the spaces you have available? Sure, yeah. We're looking forward to being back in person and when we are, we have a number of spaces uh, that you can take advantage of both in both libraries, McHenry and uh, the Science and Engineering Library. In McHenry, on the ground floor, we have the Digital Scholarship Commons, which has a bunch of different kinds of study space, but in particular, it has a DSC lab that has 12 high-end iMacs and two PCs, as well as some scanners. Um, and on, on our computers in the lab, we have an expanded list of software that you can take advantage of. We have um, a room called the Viz Lab, which is uh, a place that you can do virtual reality. We have a podcasting studio. And then in the Science and Engineering Library on the ground floor, there's a space called the Digital Scholarship Innovation Studio. And there we have our 3D printers that you can get trained on and use at no charge to you. Um, the other thing that we do out of um, the Digital Scholarship Commons in McHenry is check out equipment. And uh, this equipment includes a pretty wide range of different kinds of microphones, video cameras, as well as VR equipment uh, for checkup. That sounds great. Thank you, Daniel. You're welcome.